Now that you have your bean subscription, you have freshly roasted coffee just like the best cafes use, and all you need to do is get it dialed in. We are dialing in today on the Oracle Jet. This machine is like working with a little barista coach inside. It's gonna take us step by step through the whole process. Hi, I'm from Mecca Coffee. We are a Sydney based roaster, almost clocking up 20 years in the business, sourcing, roasting, and brewing coffees. Let's dial in house blend on the Oracle Jet. Now, assuming you've already placed a single wall double basket in the porter filter, you've selected the roast date button when setting up your machine, and you've chosen double espresso, we're at the same starting point. House blend is what we serve at our cafe slash roastery in Alexandria, boasting notes of milk chocolate, orange, and honeycomb. We started on a grind setting of 26. Your setting may be different and that's okay. This machine will guide you through to the correct number. Grab your porter filter and dry it out. I like to get out all the coffee grounds that might be hanging out in there and any water that's lingered. Insert it into the grinder and pull to the right or press the grind icon on the screen. My brew recipe is 21 grams of freshly ground coffee. We are going for 28 to 30 seconds of brew time and that will yield 45 grams of espresso plus a little crema. There it is, green icon, we are done. And just like that, grind, dose and tamp perfectly every time. Incredible, wipe off the grounds around the rim and insert it into the group head. Pull it to snug. Press the double cup button and grab your favorite cup. You shouldn't see the first drop of espresso until around the six to eight second mark. This machine is volumetric. That means once the correct amount of water flows through the puck, it shuts off automatically. If your shot is extracted correctly, it will stop running around the 25 to 30 seconds of contact time. That's about 60 mils of coffee, plus the crema in the cup. If your extraction is too fast or too slow, you'll get a recommendation to adjust your grind setting. Okay, give it a little spin. Look at that crema, it's looking delicious. House blend is what we serve at our cafe slash roastery in Alexandria boasting notes of milk chocolate, orange, and honeycomb. Did your shot look and taste like mine? This machine will prompt you when the grinder needs an adjustment. Follow the prompt, it's easy. The number one goal of adjusting the grind is to either slow down or speed up the flow of water through the bed of coffee for the most delicious shot. Don't be afraid of this step. We can always adjust it back. If the water flow is too fast, the coffee may taste sour. The Oracle Jet will prompt you to adjust the grind finer to slow down the water flow. Adjust the grind a couple of notches finer to slow down the water through the bed. If the flow is too slow, the coffee could taste bitter or roasty. The machine will prompt you to adjust the grind to a more coarse setting. Adjust the grind a couple of notches coarser to speed up the flow of water through the coffee bed. Check out this new feature on the Oracle Jet. Now you can make cold brew in minutes, not 12 hours. And cold espresso shots, perfect for an after dinner affogato. There are even recipes like the espresso martini to guide you into your happy hour from home. This machine will coach you through dialing in new coffees every time. The Oracle Jet is the perfect combination of performance and automation. It's like having a little barista built inside every step of the way. Over time, all these steps will become second nature and you'll go from having good coffee sometimes to great coffee every time. Explore all our curated specialty coffees at beans.com by Breville.